Hi, here we are going to model a pipe, just the pipe starting in X direction, going up to 1000 meters. So we'll just say 1000 here. And we need to fill out the diameter. So the diameter of the pipe is 12, which is 300, DM 300, or it is shed 40. Corrosion allowance is 1.5 mil. Pipe density will fill in later, but the fluid density, we can fill it out right now, or we can first select the material. We want the material to be A106. Uh, we want the material to be A53 grade B. So the pipe density will be automatically filled fluid density we want let's assume that it is uh, it is conveying a fluid which has a density of 1200 kilograms per square meter or per cubic meter so it becomes 0 0.0012 the temperature of the line is 120 degrees as case 1 case 2 it also runs at 95 degrees the pressure is 5000 kilopascals or 5 megapascals pressure 2 is 3750 kilopascals and hydrostatic test pressure is 1.5 times the pressure 1 so it becomes 7500 megapascals kilopascals uh, there is no refractory thickness, no density, there is no insulation on this pipe, so we don't need to fill out all of this information in. Now, next, this pipe goes vertically up. To do that, we just have to click on this button here, which says continue. In here, as Y is vertical, which can be seen here, so we are going to input 5000 millimeters as Y. Next, the pipe goes in Z direction, 2500 millimeters, continue, and 2500. Next, the pipe goes in X direction again, 5 meters. So this is the geometry of the pipe. Now, the pipe has a connection to the vessel here and a connection to the pump down here at node 10, which will be modeled next time. Thank you.